perform laundry activity for the client. We all wear clothes that get dirty and need to be laundered. Stains, dust, grease and perspiration all contribute to the dirt. When these are left on fabrics, they can cause the following problems. Stains and dirt on clothing serve as a breeding ground for bacteria, fungi and other potentially harmful organisms which can lead to skin problems and poor personal hygiene. Dirty clothes lose their freshness and stink. Dirt and stains on clothing reduce the fabric's strength. Nobody looks good in stained or dirty clothes. Remember to make certain preparations whenever you launder clothes at home. We need to gather all of the dirty clothes and washing supplies in one place. It aids in energy conservation when washing. Consider the following while sorting your clothes. Fabric type, color, size and weight. The quantity of dirt. The article's usefulness. Soaking time. The amount of detergent and bleach needed as these vary depending on the fabric. If the color of another garment bleeds onto white fabric, it may stain. Dusters, kitchen towels and dish clothes, undergarments and socks must be washed separately to maintain good hygiene. Read the clothing's labels. All textiles and textile products have labels that provide basic information about the product such as the contents, washing and ironing instructions and so on. These instructions are stamped at the start and end of the fabric roll as well as along the sleeves. Reading these thoroughly will aid in the care of the fabrics. Methods of washing clothes Laundry methods that are commonly used are Hand wash Hand washing is the most traditional and widely used method of laundry. Water, detergent soap or powder and a clothes cleaning brush are used. This method is ideal for washing everyday clothes that are lighter in weight and less soiled and dirty. Machine wash Laundry machines have become extremely popular in the last two to three decades due to their ease of use and time savings. Modern washing machines are extremely useful for washing all types of clothes regardless of fabric. Dry cleaning Laundry clothes in a machine has become extremely popular in the last two to three decades because it is simple to use and saves time. Modern washing machines are extremely useful for washing all types of clothes regardless of fabric. Wardrobe organization. It not only keeps the house neat and clean, but it also saves time in finding the necessary garments. Let's look at how to organize your clothes. Sorting the clothes is the first step in organizing them. If you keep your clothes in multiple locations, consider sorting and organizing them one at a time. Hang the clothes that might wrinkle while folded. Use plastic or wood or stainless steel hangers. It is recommended that clothes be hung according to their height. For example, longer length clothes such as dresses should be hung at one end of the hanging rod or cupboard, followed by shorter length clothes such as t-shirts and blouses.